Thank you for tuning in to Ray Screws. We're going to do a Matchbox case unboxing video. This is an M case assortment. Uh, I'm pretty sure that we're going to have a special uh, police related model in here. Brand new model for 2017. So I'll be showing some police models afterwards. We'll take a look at this uh, police five pack as well. After I do the unboxing, let's go ahead and check it out. Now hopefully it's in here. Would be a little bit embarrassing have that whole intro and then and then the model not be in here brand new model for 2017 let's see what we have mm, is it here mm, I don't notice it just yet oh yeah there it is right there okay let's go ahead and take out some cars oh, a little squished in there we have the 16 Chevy Camaro convertible two samples and there's the convertible. You have your headlight decorations. Nice wheels. Nice color on the wheels to where it's just kind of subtle. And taillight decorations. Here we have Terraniac. I like this model. It's kind of fun. Six wheelers. And this part comes off, by the way. You can separate it. Triple axle, six wheeler, Terraniac. Tesla Model S. We've quite had quite a few colors now of the Tesla Model S. This one is white. There's your imprints in the front and tail lights in the back with um, no license plate. It's just black. It's just blacked out. Here we have the Ford F-150 contractor truck. Mm, yep, this is not the first release. I think it was in red. I think it was in red before. And because it has this plastic accessory, it might not have an interior. That's why you have the kind of uh, blocked out windows. Mm, that's my recollections. I don't do customizing, so I don't take them apart. I couldn't tell you for sure. The 68 Ford Mustang. When it first came out, I believe it was called Mustanger. There you go. Number 12. Fun to collect. Uh, Mustang fans really liking it, even though it's a little, uh, it's lifted. Uh, it's uh, out there for being in the mud. It's another, it's a new model in addition to that one coming up. Here you have the tree lugger, and it's a, uh, it's a not a fast fantasy model, but they call them Matchbox Originals. Uh, we'll just take a look at it right now, real quick. Because later on, I'm going to focus on police cars. So, th so this part here, they have it here, and then they transport it to where it's going to be planted. Uh, it might be a different model than I was thinking of, actually. There you go. That's the one we're going to talk about. There's another tree lugger. Check it out. Speed Trapper. Another new model to this case. Speed Trapper. Look, at it. it looks like the, you would sit right there and drive it, right? Ah, uh, no, that's not what it's for. Both are the same. It's, a, it's one of those things to where they can park it on the side of the road and you can, they can uh, get your, uh, have a radar and then get your speed. It looks like it has a little lever right there to spin around. Probably has different things that, to say inside there. Let's go ahead and check it out. And you can see here, it has a uh, hitch. So that's one of the things we're going to look at, look at in a moment. Here's a look at the base. K29 produced the 29th week of 2017. Made in Thailand, Speed Trapper. And there's the uh, model number. So if you search the internet for DVK12, you'll find Speed Trapper. And there's the Thailand elephant. They put that on there so that they have proud in the work that they do. Very cool. Uh, let's see, what's this here? Does it show different things? I don't know if I can get the light in there. That one right there says zero or 80. It's kind of hard to see. That one says 50. I don't know if I can get the light just right. 11. 90, oh, 90. Oh, you're in trouble. <laughs> that one says 90, you're in trouble. Speed Trapper on the license plate. Nice decorations. Uh, that's it for the whole thing, actually. All the prints are on this side. 
So they were able to make it look nice. <laughs> this part right here made it look like a seat. So we'll, we'll check it out, see what other Matchbox models we can tow it with. Because you can't drive it there by yourself. It's, uh, it's on the trailer. Here you have Ridge Raider in green. It was in a previous case. It's not the first assortment. Mm, Blockade Buster. I don't think this was in the last assortment. We must have four different colors of this now. And yeah, this spins around. The turret is able to be rotated. Here you have the MBX RV, previously the MBX motorhome. Uh, I love this casting. Hey, you can see right in there. I got, I got my light a little high, and so it's causing it to light up right into the uh, cavity there. You can see right through the roof. Very nice. And I like collecting this one. Another uh, Matchbox Originals models that I like to collect is that one right there, this one. That's the Aqua, Aqua King. Pontiac Firebird Formula, orange, kind of a burnt orange. You have the eagle on the roof. Oh, I thought there was two of them. That's carryover from the last case. Here you have the, did I show the name just in case? 71 Pontiac Firebird Formula. Here you have the International Scout 4x4 in light blue. That was in the last case. This is M case, so L was before it and that was in there. So was this. Uh, very nice that this is carrying over. This one got extra decos too. It looks fantastic on the roof. I already opened it up in the last case unboxing video, the 70 Datsun 510 Rally. Ah, I ran out of breath. The 70 Datsun 510 Rally. So I won't uh, focus on it in this video. Here we have the Tractor King. It's got a tow hitch right there so it can pull things like the... Uh, it should be able to pull this here. It's got its hitch. And Road Roller in blue and white. Here you have the Malibu Marauder, a Matchbox original. Dark Flash for the imprint on the side. MBX up there on the quarter pa panel. Nice, uh, nice color presentation. Fun little model. We have three models left. And this one I said Aqua King. It's another Matchbox Fantasy model that I like to collect. This one says uh, Juice Instinct. MBX, Sahara Survivor, and like an olive drab color. And uh, another thing, we have two six wheelers in the case. Here you have ATV, six by six. Fun stuff. This one tends to wind up in uh, five packs kind of often, especially for the uh, jungle themed five packs. Let's check out some police models coming up next. Here we have a Matchbox Police 5-pack, five, five police decorated models. Here you have a van, you have like a horse trailer. Mm, it might be a Chevy Suburban, I'm not sure. SUV, there's a tractor, and there's a helicopter on top. Uh, it does not say police. They, they stopped putting the actual name of the 5-packs on the packaging. Uh, I think mainly because they had to go to like I everything's international so that they can sell everything everywhere. And let's go ahead and check out these. Nice to see the horse trailer back. I don't know if that's its official name. And it's also nice to get a van back in the lineup. Especially with, uh, well, oh well. I was going to say, especially since it has a lot of metal in it, it's nice to get this back in the lineup. And then uh, now I know why they're able to put it in the lineup with uh, all that metal. It's because it probably doesn't have an interior. Oh, that's all right. You know, when you play with it, when you display it, you're probably not even going to notice. That's one cost-cutting measure I guess they have to get this into the lineup. The other is the light bar is the same as the... Uh, interior or the windows it's the same piece mm, the police models that I'm going to show you coming up in a moment they are some you'll see like a transition between them being able to have the light bars uh, separately a separate piece forward panel van light bar being a separate piece and then now it's uh, nowadays it's basically just the window popping up through the through a skylight type thing here is Police mounted unit, nice clear windows, mm, no opening doors, 
Let's see what it says on the bottom. Huh? Pony trailer. Copyright 2016. This might be a might be a new model. Uh, I don't recall it to be sh to be honest with you. I don't recall it. K32 for the production code. So this was produced this year, even though it's 2016 on the package. Here's the uh, copyright there, 2016 for the package. Matter of fact, I just picked it up today, as a matter of fact. So it, this is a uh, current pack that, at least in the USA, you're able to find as a hitch. We'll be able to test that out in, in a moment. Uh, the van, no hitch, so you can't pull it with the van. Here you have a SUV type vehicle, police decorations. And here we have the Ford Expedition. I said Chevy, huh? Sorry about that. Uh, should I have known? Mm, nah, I wouldn't have been able to tell, to be honest with you. I know Ford pickup trucks now because I'm noticing they have a dip right here in the window. So that's how I can quickly tell a Ford myself. Ford Expedition. And this might have been, this might have been out before Mm, I don't have any, actually, I don't have a Ford Expedition model set to the side. It's not actually, it's not actually a police vehicle. They gave it police decorations. No push bar, no light bar, nothing to indicate that it's actually supposed to be a police model in the lineup, but, you know, they can, they can decorate it. 911, that's our emergency code here in the USA, 911. And here's how you're supposed to tow the horse trailer. Or the pony, what was it called? Pony something. Pony trailer. Here's this model here. Acre maker. Acre maker. Uh, I have enough colors of this one. Well, it's like a tractor. And here you have the tow it, titch. Uh, I, have a, I have my turntable, so we'll test the towing in just a moment. And the last one is this helicopter. I gotta look at the name because Mission Helicopter. So you have the uh, nicely spinning rotors. That was pretty good. And this should pull out. There you go. Uh, this is one of my favorite Matchbox helicopters in the lineup. Okay, let me get my turntable now. Now, Acre Maker had the tow hitch. So we'll go ahead and uh, test it out. Hey, pretty good. Wow, that's really good on a flat surface. Staying together real well. Uh, if you're on a carpet, it, it'll probably bounce around and come off. That case had another model that had a tow hitch. Uh, let's see, Tractor King. Tractor King had a tow hitch. Well, I want to keep that one in the package. I don't need to open up every single one. Here is a red sample from uh, some time ago. There's the tow hitch. Let's try that out. Yep, very, very good. Now let's go ahead and try speed speed trap. Is that what it was called? Speed trapper. Speed trapper. Let's go ahead and take this off. Put it on. Check out the clearance. Wow, pretty low. <laughs> pretty low. Well, there you go. Working really nice. Oh, sorry. There you go. Here's that Ford Expedition, and I, I might have accidentally said uh, Chevy Suburban. Here is a Chevrolet Suburban that I was I was thinking of. Wow, big difference in the size of the models. Uh, it has a tow hitch. This is a more recent version. I shouldn't say recent. Uh, base code's G12. So if we're in K, G, H, K. This is two years ago, and it does have a tow hitch. There you go. Now. Uh, this one does have a uh, light bar version. I had it sitting right here, and oh, here we go, it's down here. This one is the 2000 Chevy Suburban. Same model, but this one is E09. So this one's about four years ago, I guess. Check it out, it had a light bar on top, very nice. Has a tow hitch. I don't have a whole lot of police models with uh, tow hitch capabilities. But to be honest, uh, you don't have to have a police. They don't have to have, a, uh, I guess they should have a, a police decorated model to take Speed Trapper out to the street. And you can use a street, a regular consumer vehicle, but it probably should still have police decorations. I think it's pretty fun to get models like this. It's kind of like Meter Made, a Matchbox Originals. 
kind of small, kind of fun. You look at it, you know what it is. It's, it's that person driving around that gives you tickets. Uh, no tow hitch. Someone, someone else is going to have to take care of that part. Now I'm going to use my rotating display stand. There's going to be a clicking noise. Uh, sorry, you know, but it's going to help me keep moving along so I don't get stuck on a model too long. This, this one's actually just called Police Car. That's its name, Police Car. Matchbox generic police model. This was pretty cool because it had an opening trunk and you have some stuff in the back there. Even though this is an older model, you can see that the uh, light bar is not present. But I love the opening uh, trunk. This model here, Hazard Squad. It's actually a police vehicle. I mean, it's actually a fire department vehicle. But they gave it uh, police decorations. I think I need this about right here. So, you know, there, there's a lot of vehicles that they can turn around and put a uh, police decoration on it. Like this one right here. MBX Police. Uh, yeah, it's an armored, armored truck. Still fun to collect. This sample, this must be a more recent sample. It looks like a plastic body. Plastic body. Metal base. Up next, this is a fantastic, uh, this is a fantastic model. 93 Ford Mustang. LX with your light bar. Here you have your uh, headlights. <laughs> We're not doing too good. You have your, uh, looks like a separate piece, not maybe not a separate piece for the headlight, but the plastic window comes through to the front. Now this one, uh, this one's a mouthful. You have the Lamborghini Gallardo LP560-4 police version. No tail hook. I don't know why. Why don't I have a, a hitch? I don't know. Uh, I have quite a, have a, quite a few of this model here. You know, uh, sometimes they've been a little limited as to which models they can put in the lineup. But I pick up every color, like the 56 Buick Century Police. It's had at least a few colors as well. There you have a white. And see, once again, it's a more modern, so you have the light bar being part of the window. That's why it's the same color. Here's the black sample. Clear window. It has the clear police siren. And there is a light blue version as well. Mm, that one might have been first as a matter of fact. Now those are licensed. Let's, let's check out another generic. Here you have Sport SUV. That's the name of the model. Sport SUV. Light bar on top. Fantasy model. This is police related, right? SWAT, the SWAT truck, S-W-A-T. Uh, they've changed this one as well. You can see the metal base. You can see the metal on the side. And you see the metal in the back. Well, actually, this part right here is plastic. They, the metal doesn't go up that far anymore. How about let's go back to a licensed police model. We have the Dodge Charger. Ooh, looking good. Looking good in black. That's not the only Dodge Charger that they have. They also have the Dodge Charger Pursuit. That one's got a push bar and a light bar. And if you notice, it's an older model, right? You can tell right away because windows and the, and the lights on the top do not match. Uh, you know, for that sport SUV, I had two samples to show you. Remember this one? Yeah, I forgot to show you this one. I have it in a baggie. It must have come in one of those Easter eggs or something like that. And that's why it's uh, wrapped in the bag. This one, I, I didn't look up the name. It is a BMW. Uh, it's probably, it has a long name. When I edit this, I'll put the name on the bottom. That's what I'll do. Now let's check, take a look at uh, this one. A lot of people, ooh, what are you doing over there? A lot of people like to collect the Dodge Monaco police car. And uh, that's me. I like to collect it as well. Mm, I don't know if... Uh, I try to get only police cars. This one has sheriff's decorations. And eh, good enough. I know you want to see it anyways. Highway patrol. Close enough. Police. Highway patrol. Well, too late. You're looking at it. Now we have the Dodge Magnum. Another one in the sheriff. I don't think we've seen the Dodge Magnum in quite some time. There's a black sample. 
And here we have a silver sample. Now, same thing, we have the Ford, this is an older model, Ford Crown, Ford Crown Victoria. This is from uh, Dare, I'll show you in just a second. They had a whole series of cars with uh, Dare decorations, and it was drug abuse, resistance, edu education, is that what Dare stood for? I have spent some time, probably almost 20 years for that. Light bar on the top. Now that was the, uh, that's the Crown Vic, right? Well, they did have a, uh, another Crown Vic with a push bar. This one is the newer version. I say newer, it's, it's newer than this one that I just showed you. 2000 Chevrolet Impala. This one might have been a multi-pack exclusive color. It might have been. How about a Mitsubishi Lancer Evolution X Police? I don't think it's 10 Police. I don't know. I'm just reading the base. There's a black sample. How about a blue sample? Now another, uh, another European model that has been, another European police car that's been in the lineup quite a bit, and it's another one where I pick up all the colors. Subaru Impreza WRX. Light bar is different color than the window, so you know that one's not a recent. Here's a another one from a few years ago. I could look on the base and get the codes. We're gonna keep moving. And this one's this one's older. Uh, I remember when they had like a ice series, and so they were putting the white wheels on some of them. I picked it up anyways, you know. What can you do? You like it? You like it. And Ford Police Interceptor. Push bar and a light bar. That's what I like. Fargo Police. I'm not going to attempt a uh, Fargo accent, sorry. And last but not least, I have one more Dare car to show you. Here you have the Camaro Z28. Camaro Z28. There's a whole series, I think maybe like uh, 12 cars. Uh, one day I'll make a separate video of those just alone. And here's a look at the hood on the other one, Dare. What I say on there? Now that's the slogan, Dare to keep kids off drugs, drug abuse, resistance, education. Uh, I hope that's what I said. If not, I hope so. <laughs> Anyways. Thanks for checking out my Matchbox case unboxing video and sticking around for the bonus content. Happy collecting. Bye-bye.